And uh, the, the previous speakers have said, obviously, our thoughts uh, today are with the people in Japan suffering from this terrible tragedy. And uh, especially with the workers who are battling to stable the situation at the Fukushima nuclear power plant. I think we have to pay tribute to their bravery. Meanwhile, the world is watching and looking at um, and have reopened the nuclear debate. Germany and um, China have already uh, suspended construction of their nuclear power plants. Meanwhile, David Cameron continues to say that we need nuclear as part of the energy mix. France of the Earth thinks that nuclear power is a gamble that we don't need to take. Aside from the, the safety risks, the government's own research demonstrates that in fact we can meet all of our climate change targets without relying on this technology at all. We have, um, we may not be living on a fault line, but um, as the previous speakers have said, and as history has in fact shown, nuclear accidents can happen anywhere in the world. And as climate change progresses, we will be at risk from sea surges and rising sea levels. The effect of the government's entire focus on nuclear is to distract from actually the clean and safe technologies that can power our renewable energy future. Just a third of Britain's offshore wind and wave resource could meet all of our energy needs by 2050 as well as creating over 140,000 much needed jobs. Meanwhile though, nuclear is taking up all the cash. Not only is the cleanup that the taxpayer continues to pay for a major concern, the government's proposals to reform the energy markets look set to give a windfall to existing nuclear power plants of over 3 billion just from one of their proposals. That's why Friends of the Earth is very happy to be working with COD on this issue. And I want to thank them for supporting our petition, which we um, are collecting to give to the government, in support of a clean and safe energy future. <coughs> We've also written to Chris Hewn about the uh, safety review, uh, which will be taking place to express our, our desire for that to be done entirely in public and for people on the sites of proposed nuclear power plants to have a local hearing so that actually we can decide this for the people who live nearby and who are seeking to be affected by it. We, um, Politicians need to open Excuse their me. eyes to the benefit of a clean and safe Don't renewable energy future day. and to stop and to stop looking at nuclear like it's just a given no matter what its cost might be. Thank you. Thank you very much.